Finally, here at six, the best spaghetti sauces, it seems, come from those who add just a little bit of this, a little bit of that. In 1987, Mike Stevens met a woman in Northampton County who followed that very recipe. We revisit Mike's date with the queen of sauce in tonight's trip back down the Pennsylvania Road. There's 600 or so hungry folks around Nazareth counting on Armenia Jufri to finish her work by Sunday. That's the day they'll all pile in for the annual Holy Family Catholic Church Spaghetti Dinner. There are some who say the sauce just wouldn't be the same without her. I'm going to put in a handful. Then after it's boiling, simmering for a while, then we taste it. And if it tastes okay, all right. If not, we just add a little bit more. Armenia, a tiny lady who has to stand on tiptoes to stir, does most of the cooking like that. In fact, her record book, going back the 26 years she's been involved, has recipes using handfuls of this and that. She'll tell you she doesn't worry about what goes in. What she worries about is not having enough. She ran out once. Her family doctor couldn't get any meatballs. She said, no problem, I'll make sure you get a dinner. And I made him a nice supper at home, with the spaghettis and meatballs, sauce and the cheese and the, the rolls and everything, and uh, I brought him up to the house, and that's how he had. Spaghetti sauce in the early stage doesn't do much for anyone, but you know with Armenia around, it'll get better. The folks here have something to look forward to on Sunday with her and the rest of the ladies from the Altar and Rosary Society in the kitchen, getting dinner ready for their friends. It just seems I can't say no. I mean, you know, I'm always there when somebody asks me something, well, there I am. With Armenia, that's something you can count on. I'm Mike Stevens, Newswatch 16 on the Pennsylvania Road in Nazareth.